this dress, a wig can make cuz oh your girl was looking rough okay it has been a long day you guys um, it's only like 12 o'clock if you have ever ever been in child care babysitting nanny children whatever you know how it is when kids are teething and baby boy is cutting his top row so i finally got him down he's settled he's sleeping he's dry he's fed so praise god um but y'all already know what we are here for we are here for nine day dpo um ovulation with our easy at home test and i'm not gonna keep you guys too too long but i just wanted to go ahead and do the test so y'all i thought i heard him cry um go ahead and do the test so we can get it over with and just you know go ahead and see i also want to let you guys know if we get to like 13 day P dpo and upload uh, hasn't came yet which i hope she doesn't i'm just going to go to like my local um food line or cvs and buy a digital reading those tests over and over and using up all these tests oh my god <laughs> jesus I'll be back. Okay, got him back down. Anyways, use all these tests up, um, especially like 12 day DPO, 13 day DPO, 14 day DPO. I just don't really see a point. So, like I said, once we pass, like, okay, it's period coming or not type few days, I'm just going to get a digital so that I can have peace of mind. Y'all can have peace of mind. We can just know what's going on. Also, shout out to all of my. Um, new family members, I don't call y'all subscribers, my new family members, and shout out to you guys because a lot of y'all are on your TTC journey as well, so I'm sending you baby dust, baby love, baby dancing, positive ovulation, just all of that good stuff your way, so <sighs> went ahead and peed off camera because we know from yesterday, and we're just going to go ahead and see, uh, what this test says I haven't had any okay so my hands have just been like very sweaty lately don't ask me why but they've been like extremely extremely sweaty lately and I still can't open it <laughs> you package these tests up tight honey so you gonna work to get that positive anywho um I haven't had any other symptoms or anything like related um, to pregnancy so I just wanted to go ahead and mention that the same symptoms that I was telling you guys that I had yesterday are pretty much the same um, <clears throat> nothing has changed in that category so I'm going to show you guys the test so y'all can see um, it's blank blah, 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 blank nothing on there and this is 9 day DPO. I know we still have about a handful more of days to like check and just see what's going on. Uh, so, cheers. <laughs> so, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right. And that's going across very fast. Um, I'm going to lay that down. I'm gonna cover it up because honey, honey, who was trying to see that before it's time? Not me. For all of my ladies who are testing, are you guys testing like multiple times a day? Are y'all multiple times a day? Are y'all just testing like morning, late at night? Like how are you guys doing it? For me, I know they say first morning urine is like the best, but I feel like if you're pregnant, you're pregnant in a sense. You know, like if I'm pregnant. I can test in the morning, afternoon, night, and it should say the same thing 
Um, but listen, y'all don't want to see me when I first wake up, okay? <laughs> I've been just scared all y'all away. You do not want to see this <laughs> when I first wake up. So I have to wake up, brush my teeth, lotion my face, get my day started, get some breakfast, and then I can come on the camera and talk to you guys and be bubbly. But listen, first of all, my voice would be much lower. <laughs> Do what it is now. I was like a whole dude. Um, so yeah, y'all don't want to see that. Y'all don't want to see that. But yeah, so ooh, I don't know what this is going to say. I get more nervous as the day my period can start gets closer. Like a few days ago, I was like, uh, I got time. You know, the sperm lives up to five days. Like, you know, it's okay. But now that I'm at my eight day DPO, 9 day DPO, 10 day DPO will be tomorrow. Kind of getting a little nervous because if you're going through this TTC journey and you're a part of the TTC journey or just even if you don't consider it TTC, if you're just doing it and you may end up being pregnant, if you are pregnant, you're not going to be sad about it type thing. You know how it feels to do what you're supposed to be doing, doing all the right things, trying and trying and trying, and then boom. I'm still come with her bags, her luggage, her carry-on, her different shoes, her purses, her pearls, like, I'm still comes in full force. So, we don't want that situation this month, but you know, if it is, then we are just going to rock it out. That's just giving us another month to learn new things, try new things, be educated on new things, and just, you know, overall, learning yourself, learning your body, and what you're supposed to do. So, y'all, I think it's been about three minutes. We're going to go ahead and check this test and see what it says. Uh, yeah, a bit nervous, but you know what? okay it's okay I know it's plenty of women out there who watch me and who get inspired by me and who are also on your TTC journey so we are in this together okay we're in this together um, so let's see what it says all right y'all here we go nine day DPO Easy at home test. Sorry, my hands are so shaky. All right, now it's my time to look. Do y'all see something right there? I wish I could. See, this is the thing. When you have line eyes, you see stuff like very, very faint, of course. But let me show you guys one more time. God, you know what? I need to flip the camera. Let me flip the camera. Right, y'all, I hope this is like a little bit better y'all to see i know some people won't see what i see and they say ain't nothing there but let me turn it this way hope that gives you guys a better look at things Alright y'all, signing off.